Well, very welcome to Powerhouse Museum. We are in level four Kadri's exhibition. As you can see, Weavers, Merchants and the Kings is the name of exhibition, which is 70th anniversary of Kadri's business in Australia. The founder of Kadri's, Mr. Jack Kadri, was the first uh, Iranian Jewish migrant to Australia in 1951 and he uh, created and established his business in 1952 in Sydney. Mr. Jack Kadri began to donate objects to powerhouse collections since 1962. Um, in our exhibition here, we have uh, 14 objects and our hero object is a Doroks carpet that you will see in the first gallery. This carpet is a very big one and belongs to the school of Persian carpet weaving of Doroks. Doroksh today is a city in uh, Khorasan in Iran, but back to 19th century, it was a little village where this type of big uh, Persian carpets, they were produced. Uh, Doroksh carpet, normally they have very thick edge around the carpet with a decorative uh, design in the middle. But our Doroksh carpet here in this exhibition is quite exceptional because it connects the history of Iran to India, which is our interest today. Uh, in the center of this carpet, what we see is a big city with uh, architectures which are purely Indian architecture. And in the middle of city, we see uh, European figurines, uh, humans on horse riders and hunting scenes. And on the top of this uh, architectural building, we see a sea with uh, boats on the, you know, on the water. And in the very back end, we have a, a chain of mountains with one central mountain, which is white. And then we have beautiful sky full of stars, sunshine, and each side, two moon crescent, exactly symmetry. So why this carpet is important? Uh, my personal interpretation is that this carpet commissioned by Indian office government in mid and late uh, 19th century to the Doroksh carpet weavers in the uh, city of Doroksh and probably what we see in the two-thirds in the city architecture here is the port of Surat in Gujarat. Port of Surat, historically, we have uh, documents which will prove they were in touch with Iran since 7th century. Exporting material and importing mostly Persian carpets from Khorasan, the region where this carpet uh, was created. So, but the city of Surat that we see in this carpet is during colonial period. This is why the figurines, they dress in red uniforms, probably British officers. But city also is in the beginning of industrialization. You have the Shomini from where we have black smokes come out. But my interpretation, if you go a little bit up in the image, that water is the Persian Gulf area. And the land behind and the mountains are Persian mountains and what we have in the middle, the white one, is symbol of Persia, Damavand mountain, which is always uh, white in Persian iconography. And that beautiful sky full of stars, sun and two moon crescent, in my idea is showing the knowledge of um, celestial knowledge for navigation for maritime route and commerce between Persia and India. It means those that use those uh, boats for navigation, they use the knowledge of astronomy for finding their ways between India and Persia. And the techniques of weaving is Persian weaving. So yes, this is a nice uh, object, material culture to which we can understand the connection between India and Persian culture. Thank you so much for speaking with us. Thank you for your time.